Van Harps fan cam. Bose won, Harps won. Live with Thomas here and Oshin giving her, her ma after match thoughts. Overall thoughts of the match, lads? Uh, you know, the 1 1, I guess, Bose, I'll take that on a day, but I felt like after after the UCD game, we, I was disappointed in the result, but then on Monday, then we, on the first half, we showed, our, we showed our positives, and then in the second half, then we kind of fell back. We kind of felt like we started from the second half, then we pulled it back in today. I guess Bose and my fairly brought it back and glad we got the one point anyway. Happy out. Oh, Sheen, what are you thinking? I uh, like there is positives, but there's a couple of things that need to change badly. Like Barry out and Dwight again today. Like what's that about? He needs to be the ten. Just he just needs to be the ten. Like honest day is one of the best playmakers in the league. Like and he's been wasted out wide again. But um, up top as well. Like Philippe's, he's been positive. Like. Yo yo, well, that's be good. Yo yo, oh, like. that's big way. No. Yeah, no. <laughs> early days, <laughs> but, early days. But um, McWood as well off the bench, like he's he's promising. Bit of pace about him, works hard. So can't ask for much else, like. Yeah, and that's it. Like with with, with McWood's off the bench, it's a good option to have. But like Tunde last year, when when uh, when Foley started and so on, uh, it was good to have McWood's off the bench. So hopefully, you know, it's also the early days. It's hard to. You know, to judge a player on a few matches, so hopefully, you know, the, the squad will gel over the next few weeks. Uh, your star players for tonight's match, who do you think uh, done well? Or Tonight, I, know, I think Ryan Rennie deserves a... My, my man in the match tonight, I think he was just superb. He, he was brought out under the, under the right wing-back position and he, and he excelled, really. He kind of kept us on it, he put a few balls up forward and I thought he was our best player on the pitch tonight. And Ashley, what do you think yourself? It's hard to look past the goal scorer, like it. Yeah. It, it was some finish to be fair, but... Um, Aye, sure. We'll take the point and we'll yeah. move on. Mate. Take the point and move on to, to St. Pat's next week. What, what are you uh, confident in that there? Or do you think I'll get a, a point or two? Obviously, we're back in Fun Park again. Two home know. games in a week. And, or Pats, in a week in a row. Pats against Shells looked very good. Then last week, they, were, they weren't great, like, but yeah. I don't know how they got on tonight. Uh, they, I think they won tonight they won against Shamrock Rovers, so they're uh, up and down, so you could catch them on a break at you know, uh, Fun Park and so on. And uh, obviously, it'd be. Uh, the return of Tindy. Yeah. That'll be interesting. That'll be interesting, very yeah. interesting. So yeah, you would you be fairly confident of getting a, a result or we'll probably take another point there. Next yeah, you take another point and move on for the season. Obviously, you know, obviously still chasing that first one. Obviously got a first goal tonight as as Samuel mentioned already, so Hopefully, you know, things will move in the right direction and we'll be able to pick up points as we Some go along. Dry, we're going to have to stop settling for points though. We're yeah. going to have to get the win out somewhere. Yeah, and that's it. Like, and even let's go back to the point. Uh, it was made about, uh, you know, having Barry McMee out in the, out in the left. Uh, uh, you know, I think most Harps on out would agree with you, but it's basically it's probably down to the players that are available this uh, year and so on. So, you know, we'll see. We'll see what happens. But well, thanks to Thomas and Ashwin for coming on and give our thoughts. Anyway. Ben Harps! Ben Harps!